This video will be an introduction to the Cornerstone Wall Designer software. This is our newer retaining wall design software, a version of Vespa created by CTI Software. You can download it for free from our website here by going to magnumstone.com, clicking Design Software, and then Design and Analysis Software. With this software, we'll be able to create profiles like this one and cross sections like these of our different styles of retaining walls. It'll also produce quantity takeoffs to get the number of blocks, reinforcement, and backfill required for construction, as shown here. To start, we'll open the software and create a new project and input some project information, like the client, project name, project location, project number, and project designer. You can choose which methodology you'd like to use, and if you're planning to design a magnumstone gravity wall, make sure you choose NCMA or National Concrete Masonry Association. You can choose either Imperial or Metric, set the folder path to where you'd want to save your file, and you're ready to create a wall. We'll call this Wall 1. Now that we have a wall, we have these tabs that will go through from left to right. We have our factors of safety here, if we want to adjust any. Next, we have our Wall Unit tab, where we can choose Magnumstone as our product line. We have a couple of options here, if we check multi-depth set, we can choose gravity with extenders, or we can choose magnumstone friction for a standard MSC or mechanically stabilized earth wall with geogrid, or magnumstone positive connection for our mechanical connection reinforced walls. We can also choose the batter here. In the next tab, we can set our reinforcement. We have a few suppliers to choose from, and we can bring them over to be used by selecting a strength of geogrid and clicking this arrow. For gravity walls, we can skip this tab. For soil conditions, there are presets for many options of soils for the reinforced, retained, and foundation soils. We can also adjust the friction angle or unit weight if needed. There's also an option to check a phase drain, blanket drain, or chimney drain. To do a seismic analysis, we can go to this tab and we can check this box and input a peak acceleration value and other parameters. Once all that is set up, we can either create a cross-section or profile for a retaining wall, which I'll show in the next videos.